The world is full of magical places to visit and experience, but traveling can be a challenge in many ways, including the expense. There is a way to see these places and even fly a drone, all while enjoying the comfort of your couch. Arshan Stiles introduces us to Nature Eye in this Earth 8 report. Drones and the cameras that are on board them can take you to incredible places, giving you sights you've never seen before. But you can't fly everywhere. Well, there's a company called Nature Eye that can take you to locations like Machu Picchu, as well as Botswana and all other locations around the world, all while helping conservation. Well, my name is Eric. I will be the tour guide for this flight. We would fly our drone in and around the cloud forest of Machu Picchu, Pueblo, Peru, and then later would fly to Elephant Sands in Botswana, Africa. The interesting thing is I've never flown a drone before. But before you get to take off, you have to spend some time in a self-taught flight school. After about 10 minutes, you're good to go. Back to our guide, Eric, at Machu Picchu. So there is the the end of the Andes, and is the beginning of the jungle. That's what we call the cloud forest. Who assists us in the takeoff to get us up above the town of Agua Caliente. And you can see the people playing soccer in the field there, and you, you know, exactly, watch the game. Now at this point, you have three options. You can do the flying, let your guide do the flying, or go to the drop-down panel and select from points of interest, and the drone will fly you there automatically. No matter what you decide, your guide's always there sharing local knowledge. In the village, we are at uh, 7,000 feet. In Machu Picchu, we are at 9,000 feet. While Eric flies us around, this is Michelle Wheel, Chief Marketing Officer for Nature Eye. So we came up with the idea to allow people to fly a drone remotely in these iconic locations around the world, uh, be able to control the drone, and then we give up to half of the revenue back to those local organizations. Most were struggling during the pandemic. Since then, that has changed, but the focus is still on the people that are there. We're always respecting the, the people, the wildlife, um, and, and the local rules and regulations in every location where we fly. In the beginning, Nature Eye was just in Africa. Then expanded our geography outside of Africa to South America, to Asia, to places in the United States. And now we have uh, 11 locations live on our website that people can fly. Our African flight was in Elephant Sands, Botswana. There, that's what we're heading towards in front of us, that area of dark. But unlike Machu Picchu, the landscape here is vast, and having a guy and using points of interest pays off. Joining me along in the fight is Jonathan Duff, the CEO and former teacher. When I joined Nature Eye, it, it became incredibly apparent to me that this was a tool uh, that was going to allow students to engage in a way that they simply can't normally do in a school environment. You see the way they're all just shifting backwards, stepping backwards, making some space. That's because it's in real time, not VR, a tour, or something that's pre-recorded. So when they suddenly find that they're flying a drone live on the other side of the world, speaking to a guide who's based in that location uh, is really unique. So it really just increases the value of the learning and the teaching they're already doing. What makes it possible is state-of-the-art drones with powerful lenses, high-speed internet, 5G, and Starlink satellites, and access is reasonable. So any nature I flight is $95. You can choose from all of our different locations around the world. For that, you get a 30-minute flight at, at the location that you choose, and each flight is a uh, has a guide on it so we have a local guide on the ground at each location you also get a twofer and you can choose a friend from anywhere else in the world to join you and you can both take turns flying you can both see the experience you can communicate with the guide um, and you can take photos during the flight that you can download after so if flying over incredible locations around the world interest you or maybe your kids school would be interested in a flight i'll put a link up to nature eye on this web story sean styles earth eight